What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another Pokemon news update video. In today's video, we're going to go over the newly announced Pokemon release dates for Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl, which will be released on November 19th, 2021, as well as Pokemon Legends Arceus, which will come to the Nintendo Switch next year, January 28th, 2022. Yes. These are officially announced release dates by the Pokemon Company. Nintendo posted it as well on the Twitter. It's currently up on the official Pokemon website. I'm going to have that linked in the description below as well as a pinned comment on this video so you guys can check it out as well. Now, I wanted to go over this on the channel because I just recently did a video basically debunking the rumored release dates that were on Amazon.com that I was getting a ton of feedback on on via my Twitter and my Instagram and shout out to the people that were keeping me honest and sending me those information so I can cover it here. However, I was, like I said in that video, it's not official until it's officially announced by the Pokemon company by Nintendo. And that's what we got today. We got the official release date, surprisingly, not just to Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shiny Pearl like I thought we were going to get via E3 with a brand new trailer. We also got the release date for Pokemon Legends Arceus, which again comes out next year, January 28th, 2022. The most interesting part of this is that while we got the box art, which I'm going to have on screen, which is beautiful by the way, especially the Diamond and Pearl remix box art looks incredible the pokemon legends box art is eh, kind of looks like they you know are very inspired by breath of the wild and they want people to know that but yeah if i had to choose which box art was betterly done i would say the the diamond and pearl remakes 100 percent. but that's neither here or there i'm just kind of surprised that we didn't get again a trailer associated with this new drop it was just a random tweet on a random wednesday especially considering we got the kind of leaked the rumors about a pokemon presents happening before e3 technically it's about that time before e3 so i would be expecting this pokemon presents if it was to happen happening or announced fairly soon so once i got like the notifications that the diamond and pearl release dates and as well as the pokemon legend arceus release dates first thing that came to my head was like all right let me just wait for the trailer and do a reaction to the trailer when we get the trailer later on today and lord and behold the day is almost gone and still no trailer which is fairly odd no pokemon presents announcement anything just here's the release date here's some box art there you go now i'm not mad or anything i don't want that to be the narrative of this video i just kind of figured that we would get something i don't know i thought we were going to get some kind of a trailer or something to announce the release dates and we didn't get that they also announced that brilliant diamond and shiny pearl is also going to have a double pack to no surprise it actually looks like a cool box art with both of the legendary Pokemon in front of, like always, looks beautiful. The 3D models and like graphic quality, it's just incredible of Dialga and Palkia. It, it kind of, it's kind of hard to see, but I would highly recommend everyone just grab these images, zoom in, look at Palkia's mouth and tongue and everything looks worn. It looks like they've been in fights. It, it just looks super clean and clear which is very rare for a pokemon game to look this good granted this is just the box art and the games aren't gonna look half as good as this but these are beautiful box art indeed especially over the pokemon legend arceus which again to me is like huh huh now i couldn't end this video without bringing up that pokemon home is also getting a update and new features and stuff like that i want to do a full video on that when it comes out and just like kind of cover all the new features and everything that's coming to it i might just do that in a separate video for tomorrow rather than just squeeze all the information here i just wanted to go over the release dates with you guys i'm very excited about brilliant diamond and shiny pearl the fact that they're so close together too this may be the first time in pokemon history that we're getting literally games months apart from each other big games months apart from each other granted one of them is a mainline rpg the other while it is still an rpg it's kind of a single player based story game from what we know now joe merrick and pokey jungle was actually talking about this on twitter and i wanted to bring it up that on the japanese website they updated the pokemon brilliant diamond and shiny pearl 
to be up to four players while pokemon legend arceus is still listed on the japanese website as being a single player game now we don't know if it's gonna have you know single player but then also allow online battles i don't see that too far of a stretch at least online capabilities so you could do one-on-one -on -one battles with other people playing the similar game pokemon legends arceus but brilliant diamond shining pearl it will be up to four players so it looks like we're gonna have at least double battles vgc style events and stuff like that probably gonna be on brilliant diamond and shiny pearl after those games get released it looks like pokemon legend rcs if they are focusing on the story and being a single player game and single player experience that's cool but again it answers that question that everybody was saying like hey if we're getting two games from Sinnoh back to back like what does that do with the pokemon pool like are, are we playing vgc and pokemon legend arceus is it a different battle battle system like how is everything gonna work and I think it being a single player game kind of answers that and saying hey we are gonna have the VGC stuff living in Brilliant Diamond and Shiny Pearl and Legends Arceus is just gonna be a single player one take you're done experience now granted they could also keep VGC you know stuff like that inside of Pokemon Sword and Shield that's not outside of the realm of possibility and to be honest I think that might be where they're going I would love to see Brilliant Diamond and Shiny Pearl become the games, especially with the pool of Pokemon that they're going to have in that game. Kind of scaling it back to tons of classic mons as well as, at least while these games are the main games, putting a highlight on these Pokemon. I think that would be pretty cool, but we will have to wait and see. So I did scroll through the Pokemon Legends and the Brilliant Diamond and Shiny Pearl website. Nothing new on the sites, again, besides the pre-order and the, the release date and the box art for these brand new games. But again, I will leave that in the description below as well as a pin comment on this video so you guys can check it out yourself so let me know in the comment section below are you happy with these release dates i am to me they're kind of stacked november 19th and then again on january 28th as somebody that's going to be here trying to cover these games whoo we got a busy couple of months from november to january especially with pokemon day 2022 <laughs> this whole the next year around November to January is going to be a legendary one. So let me know your thoughts about it in the comment section below. Like always, guys, I answer all comments, so let's have a conversation about it down there. If you're new around here, consider hitting that subscribe button. New videos like this every day. Talking Pokemon, Fortnite, Mario, Call of Duty, whatever I feel like dropping vibes on, I drop it here on the channel. So again, consider hitting that subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as moving the video and to recommend this so other people can check out the videos. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you're not a subscriber and you made it this far, hit that subscribe button. You know you want to. Join the family. Ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time I drop one of my videos. As well as hit the like button on this video so it can be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family. If you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as Twitter, Instagram, or TikTok, or whatever, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on all all of those again daddy gamer fred you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my twitter also on all of my videos i do answer all comments so again if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything just hit me up in the comment section below i take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and i love it and again let's have that conversation down there here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest i am a variety channel i do tons of stuff tons of pokemon but tons of other stuff as well so dive into these videos peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one